Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Zenitin, and welcome to today's video for Wild Frost. I say today's video, and in all honesty, I actually just got done recording the last Wild Frost video, maybe just 20 minutes ago. Um, I just really wanted to play more Wild Frost, and I decided, hey, um, I got another, I got a couple of hours of free time. Why not do a run? Uh, it's probably not going to be a couple of hours um, because this game is really difficult and I'm still learning. This is literally my second ever run. So let's go and start the run. Now, how does this work again? How do I see? Like, I want to see the, um, I think, is this the challenges? Like down here, those are our stats. I want to see like the challenges. Like are these, I'm guessing these, yeah. These are the challenges. These are what I, the things I have to do to unlock stuff in the village. Win a battle with just your leader remaining. I wonder, does that mean like leader on the field? Win a daily voyage. Okay, I might do that on stream. Achieve a three win win streak. Okay, stack 15 snow. 50 damage, 100 damage in one head. 50 shells, sack 10 allies. Stack 20 shrooms. Okay, okay. I'm gonna be honest with you. For now, I'm not gonna really aim for this stuff. I'm just gonna play through the game, try to learn as much as I can with the game. You know, learn combos, learn strategy, see more enemies, learn how the enemies work, see more cards, etc., etc., stuff like that. And eventually, when I feel like I have a good grasp, I'll start doing these things. And, you know, some of these things will probably just happen as we play. So let us start the run. All right, who do we have? I believe we saw these guys a little bit at the end. Uh, we've got Kinbat. Gain one block on kill. Hellwind. Um, deal d additional damage while alone in a row. Ooh. Okay, so that's like... So if Hellwind's by themselves, they'll basically have three damage? Okay. When hit... Apply two shroom to the attacker. This is gonna be weird. Okay, this is gonna sound crazy, but what if we use our leader as the tank? Because here's the problem. I don't know like enough about the game, so it's kind of hard for me to like, I'm trying to think of like ways to build these characters and these decks, and I don't even know if the cards exist in the game or even if I've unlocked them. I'm thinking, what if we make a leader centric tank? using Kuno, and, you know, we use poison, uh, maybe we get some blocks and shells and pu put them on Kuno. So let's go, let's try that. I like this idea. When hit, apply poison. All right. So, okay, I guess this is going to just how, be how it is at the start of every single run, where it's just like the very basic start of the map. All right, Kuno. Um, throw him up there. I've got Woodhead. Oh yeah, I should look at the deck. So, okay, so the pet is a starting companion. We don't have to do anything for. Uh, Woodhead does nothing but take a hit for you. So do we just play Woodhead? A different kind of health. So like, okay, so that, so it does seem like a companion. I want to get Snoof out here. So I could, I could play Woodhead to tank the damage from the Pangoon, or I could just kill it, in all honesty. Um, so you deal three. So I'm going to do it like this. Yeah, there we go. And you should die from the poison. And we can pull down here. I'm going to play Woodhead just to see what Woodhead does. Okay, it is just a, another unit. It doesn't attack, but okay, that's kind of nice. Uh, and then we'll just kill you. All right, all right. I Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I forgot about this. Uh, Waddle Goons. Well, let's move everyone up here. And... Sunrod? 
get some money while I'm here. Seems nice. Waddle goons will probably. They, I just noticed the frenzy. Um, am I using my old deck? Hold on. No, this is not my old deck, is it? Because I've got a. I saw the flame water and I was like, is this my old deck? But no, we got woodhead. Okay, sure. So that's a lot of health you got there. I want to start snow, snow sticking this. I could just kill the gobbling. Let's just kill the gobbling. Okay, so you'll hit. Um. Yeah, let's just keep whacking away at the waddle goons. Nice. Extra snow. And then Kuno finishes it off. Lo I'm going to be honest with you. I forgot there was more. All right. Um. Huh. So I can have Snoof just kill something now, but I'd rather not. I want to draw... Get a basic sword and have Snoop hit Big Peng. And I guess we'll chip away here a bit. So a little more damage on Kuno. I do need a heal. Like, I feel like that is going to be a problem here. It's just I need heals. Um, let's just kill the Pengu now. This should have Snoop attack. Nice. Keep applying snow. So I feel like I've got a weird... I don't know. I feel like Snoop does not go well with what Kuno is trying to do with the whole slowing them down so they don't attack when I want them to attack because of Kuno. So yeah, I don't know about this build already, but we'll make it work. Also, I don't know how many companions I can have. Oh, it splits off right away. So you start with a battle and then it splits. Okay, so those are companions. Treasure is a card. So I can get two companions or I can get money and then companions. Let's get two companions. Ooh, who's this Bonnie? She's cute. Restore... So countdown four, restore to all allies. So she doesn't do anything but heal. Okay. What do you do? Three health, three shells. Deal additional damage equal to your shells. I don't have a shell build, but this feels like a good shell. Um, a shell build payoff. Apply snow. So these two are like, so we got a debuff guy to slow him down. A healer. I'm guessing. And a tank? I'm going to take the healer. I need damage. I think. When active, all allies retain pepper. Well, we don't have spice. Apply to frost. Temporarily reduces attack. Add new... I'm going to be honest with you. I don't like any of these. Um, my brain hurts thinking about these. A different kind of health while active. Oh, so this goes on the field. Okay, I can see I can see another way this is gonna work. So scrap builds will just take up space. Hmm. Temporarily reduces after or reduces attack. I'm gonna try this. Like, we've got, a, like, a tanky kind of build here going. Like, a just tank the damage. Um, okay. Wallop. Wallop seems like they'll be good with our pet. So I'm going to try them. So let's start a battle. All right, yes, of course, get... Kuno out there. Kuno is a tank. We just got to remember that. So we can put Kuno up front. Um, So three and five. Whenever anything is snowed, gain plus two attack. So I probably want to start hitting you. When hit, apply two snow. 
So let's get Snoop counting down. And let's get Bonnie out there as well. I think I want to have another, um, another tank. I want to get rid of Woodhead and replace Woodhead with another tank for the second row. Now, here's my problem. Is there... Let's slow this down, by the way. Is there a third row eventually? I'm a little afraid of that. I can move Kuno down here. Double hit this. Let's do that for now. This will kill the Uba Bear. Bonnie heals, but whatever. I don't know. I kind of... What do you do? Temporarily reduces attack. Okay. I can put Woodhead up here to... Eat the snow gobbler. Nice. Nice. Like that play. Um, let's we'll do this. I'm gonna be honest with you, I can't go for the gobbling. Wallop? Cool. Wallop can probably tank a bit, I'm guessing. So you hit everything in the row for two damage. That's fine. Bonnie can heal that up. I need to slow down this one. Okay, good. It's some... Like, your attack does not matter, Kuno. You're just here to take damage. Let's get Wallop up there. And I can... Flame water? Let's kill this. Yeah, that's whatever. Bonnie will heal us back up. Good job, Bonnie. Bonnie doesn't heal herself? Oh, I thought she healed herself. Okay. That's a problem. I want to see how this frost spell works. If I frost spell, like, here. Okay. Okay. Bumbo. Apply two. Barrage. Two snow and then barrage. 15 health. Okay, that's whatever. Um. Uh, so Kuno's doing whatever down there. Um, honestly, let's get Bonnie down here so I don't accidentally have her die to barrage. And... I'm gonna just... Flame water? I don't have anyone good to buff, so I just want to find a regular attack here. Or snow. Snow will work. Um, yeah, I want to start chipping away at the snow gobbler. So yeah, like this frost stinger is whatever. Like, who knows taking all this damage, but Bonnie will heal it back up. Um, I really don't like this snow move, but I gotta do it. Unless I sunrod here, slow it down. You can recall your companions by and to heal them. I no, thank you. I did not know, I forgot about that. Um, apply to... So we'll go down to... Uh, yeah, let's do this. Nice. Barely any damage. And then the heal. And I'm pretty sure it's free to do this. So let's just do this now. Um, snow you up. Very nice. Snow you up again. <laughs> um, you're barely doing any damage. We'll take the damage. Um, we'll snow you up. I just realized this is just getting stronger with every single hit I do. Uh, that might be a problem. I can bring Bonnie back out. Let's 
is a problem. I need to, like, let's move everyone down here and focus on the snow gobbler, I think. And we'll save Bonnie for... Let's bring Bonnie out now, I think? Yeah, let's bring Bonnie out now. Get her countdown going. You can hit the reach. Yeah, I know I can. Thank you. Thank you. I know. And then we'll snow stick this? That's an OTK. I could I could count down snoof to get more snow here. I can't let this thing ever hit me. And then I need to get you here. Get you back down here. And then this will kill it. The barrage will only hit Kuno, poisoning you. Nice heal. And now we can get everyone up here. Actually, yeah, put Snoof in front of Wallop. I was trying to have Wallop be our tank, but I need Snoof to be in front so we can get some snow on them. Uh, give me a stick. Wait, no, Suno, Snoof, Suno, Snoof, whatever. Snoof is going to attack first. Um, It really doesn't matter what we do here. We just end the turn. And then Snoof will hit for three. Bring him down to six. He'll hit for 12, and it should be a kill. Let's test if that works. I want to see if I have this right, if I'm starting to understand the game. Nice. Okay, I am starting to get how this works. Very clean fight there. Uh, took a little bit of damage, but whatever. Starting to understand how this works now. Charms, treasure, a shop. Two companions. I'm going to take the charm. I think charms are really good. Charm got Numlin charm. Gain Numlin. So do I put this on a regular card? Like a... Does not end your turn when played. Okay, okay, okay. Um, I would like to put this on one of my units. And I think I want to put it on Snoof. Okay, I'm starting to see how this works. Yeah, so now in Snoof, we can play Kuno. So when the game starts, we play Kuno. And then we can play Snoof if we draw them. Nice treasure here. Okay. Spore pack. There's a heal, but we got a heal. I feel like Ice Dice might actually be really good, but I haven't chosen it. I want to try this poison build I'm going for. This weird poisonous tank build. There's more poison, and I can afford it. What is this? Blaze T. Add one frenzy. Increase countdown by one. Okay. Sunlight drum. Count down one. Or count down, count down by one. Barrage. Okay, so that's kind of like our sun rod, except instead of counting down by two, it counts down by one, but it hits our whole row. Also, that just applies for a shell. That seems pretty solid for a defensive thing. Um... So I want the hammer. Like, the way I'm thinking is I want to replace my scrappy swords with these poison hammers. Um, so now I can either get another charm or I can get a card. And I think I want a charm. I don't want to fall into the trap I because this is a common trap. And that is buying charms. Or buying charms, sorry. Buying cards because it makes your deck thicker. Uh, add one frenzy and gain consume. Save for later? Like, how's this work? So. Add a frenzy. Triggers multiple times. Honestly, I kind of want to put that on. I'm not sure what I want to put it on. Flame water doesn't seem bad. Because I'm going to be honest with you, you don't have anyone for flame water. But we'll just hold that for now. Um, Will we hold it for now? Hold on. 
I could see myself putting it on. Honestly, no, I don't see myself putting it on anything. I kind of just want to use it now. This feels like a a greedy play to not use it now. So I'm going to try. Let's put it on flame water. I also want to see just how it works. Okay, so it'll activate twice and then be consumed and we won't have it. I also want a card heal. Like Bonnie's great and all, but I want a little more defense. But let's try this. Let's see what we got here. Infernoco. When an ally is killed, gain their attack. That's a little scary. But Mako Cole does nothing right now. I mean, Mako Cole will hit Kuno and just take damage. So I think we'll just get Bonnie out here now and start going. Nice. I'm just trying to think of how I want to do this. I think I should like... I don't want to snow this. I want this to hit me. But I'm going to... No, I'm going to Scrappy Sword, I think? And then this should die... Now. Nice. Now here's the problem. A lot of damage coming through. And then I can do that. Very nice. Redraw. Okay. Snoof doesn't take up the turn, so we can get Snoof out there. And if I Spore Pack, the Porcupine should die now. Um, I... Will it hit the Inferno Co? Let's test. Nice. Okay, okay. That's good. That's good to know. Nice. Okay, okay. Another Porcupine. Frostinger. Let's get everyone down here. I just want to get that poison going. Snoof will slow it down. I want to get Woodhead up here just to eat the Porcupine hit. Does it not split? Yo, was that... Okay, I was going to say, like, it has to have a phase two. Um, so you're going to just hit this, whatever. Nice heal here, not like I... I guess I will take a little bit of damage, so we'll just send this here. Um... We'll send that there. Your poison. Love it. Nice heal. Okay, now we got Wallop ready to go. You're gonna hurt. You're gonna hit Woodhead and that's it. Do I want to summon Wallop now? Yeah. Okay, you know what? I'm learning. Infernal Coat seems to hit both rows. Okay, I didn't realize that, but now I know. Um, That's fine. Bonnie will heal up Wallop. Um... I think this is how I want to poison them. Uh, um, that's a problem. I can, like, snow stick. I'm gonna be honest with you, I forgot. I was gonna move everything up here after I snow sticked, but I messed up. Um, so I should have done it like this snow stick here to activate wallop. Bonnie will heal everything. Makoko will hit Kuno. So, like that to activate Wallop. Nice. And good heals, good heals. Now, this is a little scary of a turn. <laughs> um. Okay, I got the Spore Pack. The problem is the damage... The damage happens after the attack, which is scary. 
That's really annoying. I think I'm going to Sunrod. Wait, I can kill Infernical. And if Infernical dies, we should win. And the fight is over, right? Nice. Right? Yeah, okay, good. They run. Uh, companion limit plus one. Card draw plus one. Redraw. Let's get the card draw. I would love to... Like, I want the card draw to start... Try and start with Snoof as fast as possible. All right, so we can get a charm or travelers. Of course, we want the charms. Apply two pepper. Apply seven pepper. Apply one double damage taken. Restore seven health. It has an attack thing next to it. So I'm guessing this means like it can only be used on enemies? I don't know. The peppers seem like a great thing for multi-attack users. And I'm not really a multi-attack kind of user. Also, I don't think we can skip cards. I think we just have to take cards, right? Um, so this is going to sound crazy. But demonize with wallop or demon heart? I guess demonize is the ability. Demon heart with wallop doesn't sound terrible now what's our charm we got a gnome charm what to do add one frenzy and gain aimless hit a random target in the row um i will quit it now but who wants it I kind of like putting it to the shroom hammer. Hit two things twice? Yeah, let's do that. So I'm guessing this is how we upgrade cards instead of just paying a flat fee and upgrading them at a shop like in Slay the Spire. We upgrade by attaching charms. Also, I have barely any money. But hey, maybe there's a card I'll buy. Like this, uh, this snow cake thing, I kind of like it. It seems like it's really good. So berries seem to be heals. Um, it just seems like an oh crap kind of card. Play it and stop an enemy from attacking for the rest of the fight mostly. The problem is it seems like there's a lot of enemies who have that snow limit thing. Which is basically just saying, hey, um, I can only have one snow at a time. That snow globe also seems pretty solid, and it's cheap. And I can keep replaying it. But it gets worse every time I replay it. Also doesn't do damage. Like, I have to I have to remember that. Like, these... So, snow seems like... If I'm using snow... Hmm. Restore HP to front ally equal to damage dealt. I'm actually going to skip. Like, thank you for the offers, but I'm going to skip. All right, what is this? Jab, Jolt. Lots of health, one attack. They've got Frenzy, so they basically deal two. What is this? The Gawk. <laughs> oh, hey, these, this is where this is where the demon stuff comes in. Okay, 18 health, five attack. When hit, apply one Demonize to the attacker. Hmm. Interesting. All right, Snoof can get played for free. And we can get Wallop going as well. Um, I'm gonna just buff up Snoof just to get Flame Water out of my hand, out of my deck. Like, I don't care if Jab Jotes hit me, whatever. I'm actually going to freeze up this one. This jab joke will hit me twice, so that should give yeah, poison four. And it will actually kill itself to its own poison. Um, I'm just gonna play Woodhead for now, just to get it out of my hand. Nice. 
and then you can get a nice redraw. Okay, this is going to sound weird, but I'm going to try this. I want to see just how this works now with Aimless. Okay, so it will hit it twice. I thought that I got really lucky. Also, my health is... Yikes. Now, can I Demon Heart myself? It seems like I can. Interesting. I'm going to do that. Okay, so you're just a debuffer. Cool. So, Snoof plus the Poison will kill that. Let's kill the Jab Jot to keep our Woodhead alive to just eat more attacks. Okay, so how does this work now? Like, does this go away ever? Is my question. Counts down after taking damage. Like, with the way it's worded, it just seems like it's permanent. Until I take damage, of course. So I'm scared. Um, so, okay, so this thing says zero attack. So it's still gonna attack when it counts down. So if I demon heart my own unit, I heal, get the demon thing. It didn't hit me. Oh God, it didn't actually hit. Doubles damage taken, not hit. Oh, I confused hit and damage taken, so I took no damage. So demonized didn't pop off? Is that what I'm hearing here? Um, we need to kill this. Wallop should end that. Good job, Wallop. I'm not even aiming for the gobbling. I could freeze the gobbling. Or I could just let it go through. It's only four... Blings, that's it. Um, I probably have to fight a mini boss or something here because there's another wave coming up in two turns. This is basically greed. I'm saying, do I want to fight the goblin and hit it? Basically, am I trading another round of demon eyes? Okay, here's how this is going to work. I'm gonna redraw. Interesting. I was actually trying to trying to draw into Bonnie. Yeah, Bonnie. I think I'll go here. Okay, I like that. So they should die from everything here. Nice. We'll just start hitting this. All right, Mutton Head. When snows up or when snowed, apply one to all enemies. Oh, so anti-snow character. Got it. Got it. Very scary. So I could just take some damage here. Honestly, I'm gonna take this damage because it will get rid of some demonized triggers, and we're just gonna spore pack up here. Nice. Like that. Big fan, big fan. Um. Okay. Okay, I wish I could... I wish I could get wallop. I wish I could freeze and have Demon Heart go off, but I can't. Like, I want I want to Demon Heart Mutton Head and have Wallop hit it and get double damage, but I can't. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to just cross them for now. Very nice. Um, so you're gonna hit Kumo. I'm just gonna heal Kumo. Yeah, four damage, whatever. But we healed a bunch. Um, <laughs> God. And then 
That barrage is gonna hurt so much. I think the play is move them up here. Wait, no, you've got you've got frost on, so you're doing no damage basically. Muttonhead's dealing damage, but whatever. So I think I'm gonna redraw here actually and look for Bonnie. Yeah, there's Bonnie. Okay, good. I didn't take any damage. Nice. And then poison's doing its job. Um Let's get a spore pack here. Yeah. Isn't it gonna just die now? Yep, nice. Ooh, you got a, I got a combo so I get more money? Okay, that's good to know, okay. Might wanna set those up for money. All right, so. Money and travelers or charm. Of course I'm going for the charm. Okay, I haven't seen any of these. Heartforge, when an ally is healed, apply spice. Um, these are all scraps. Okay. Trigger when spice reaches 10, destroy self. Huh? So I like put spice on this thing and then what? This card will trigger when spice equals 10. Frenzy 5? What? Oh, I see. I see. So you play the Moko totem. You spice it up to 10. And it blows up, dealing 10 damage five times is how I'm reading this. Interesting. I kind of want Heartforge. Heartforge with Bonnie seems kind of cute. Um, we'll take the charm, of course. Weakness charm. Reduce attack by two. That seems pretty solid. Um, why can't I add it to Kono? She doesn't have a charm on. Yeah, she doesn't have a charm. You have a charm. Yeah, I would like to add it to Kono. Oh, well. Um, can I add to the hammer? No, I could add it to a sword and that's it. Or Wallop and Snoof. You know what? Snoof can be our debuffer. I really wish I could increase Snoof's health, though. Alright, and another companion. I would like another tank. Or a damage dealer. When deployed, gain one freeze. I have no way to get extra shells. Apply to aimless. Frenzy two. Okay, you know how I said I want another tank? Um, I don't have shell or block synergy, and that seems like how I'm supposed to tank. So I'm gonna take wart. Companion limit. Okay. All right, I wasn't expecting this to be hit already, but okay. Um, honestly, it might be wart. I don't know. Is it wallop? It might be wallop. Wallops are damage, but with wart. Okay, we're going to try this. I'm going to remove wallop and we're going to have wart and have him just try to stack more and more poison. Okay, what is this? Deals damage to attackers. Okay. Okay, I've seen this mechanic before in other games. Um, we'll just get Kona out there while we still analyze this. So what are these things? When active, add aimless to all enemies. Okay, that's annoying. Um, you just deal damage. Okay, you're just a big guy. And what do you do? While active, add three. Oh, Oh, I like this. Can I play as these guys? I like what they're doing. This, like, 
each of them adds like an extra thing to their squad. I really want that. That seems cool. Uh, but yeah, let's get Wart going. Get him counting down. Get Bonnie counting down while we're at it, too. And a little bit of... Hammer? Okay. Good job. Nice. <laughs> Very nice. Um... Hit here. Um, let's do this just to get it out of my deck. And I would like to find. So let's get Snoof out. Let's shift around our tanks, and let's get the Heart Forge here to get some Bonnie triggers. Also, it seems like Heart Forge doesn't have any kind of cool animation or... Oh, wait, why am I even saying that? None of these do. I was like, oh, they're... where did the Forge not pop up? Um, but this looks good. We got our synergy going. Um, when hit, gain stuff. So... Interesting. So we can... Four pack up here. I like that play. Oh no! Uh, he he has to attack to put that on. Oh, I did not think that was a thing I had to worry about. Well, that's a problem. Um. Yeah, that's kind of a problem. I might be dead here, in all honesty. I don't think I'm dead. Let's get Woodhead out there for more tanking. Um... I'm gonna just... Frost Bell here? Okay, this is gonna be tough. I don't understand how I'm supposed to fight these. Like this whole, um, the teeth stuff. I'm trying to think of how am I supposed to, like, actually fight these, and I'm in a little bit of a, a little awkward to me, but I think we're supposed to use our cards here? Like, maybe that's it? Like, I don't want Snoof to attack. Snoof, be a good boy and don't attack. You're gonna die. So, I mean, I can kill it myself, but... Can I snow stick Snoof? I think I could snow stick Snoof? Whatever, we'll just kill it. Alright, what is this? Health 30, trigger when hit. But what's the trigger? That's the question, is what's the trigger? Um, is it counterattack? I'm so confused. Um, I am just gonna... Do that? I don't know if that's a good play or not. Well, I'm about to learn what the trigger does. I need a heal, please. I forgot Aimless was a thing. Aimless actually did good for me there. Um, so you'll freeze that, and you'll heal, giving us some more spice. Honestly, let's, let's redraw. Nice. Okay. Okay, it was a counterattack. I thought it wouldn't be a counterattack. All right, so we learned. We're learning. Um, More town progress. That's actually really good. I like what I was building there, except it seems like the pet was not what I wanted for Kuno. 
Uh, inventor's hut. What does this do? Hot spring construction started. Okay, inventor's hut. This one. Hey, buddy. His name's Plyus. I'll be crafting up new items that you'll find in your future travels. Okay, so this is what you... So this is how you unlock new things to find in the game. Achieve a 3x kill combo. How am I going to do that? Gain 50 blings from a single battle. Okay, so we've learned some more here. Um, we saw new stuff. We saw, like, demon eyes. We saw the ghost cat things. Um, I wonder if those enemies are going to be, like, the tribes I find. Because we saw snow enemies, and we have the snow dwellers tribe. So I wonder, do I get the demon tribe and then the ghost thorn whatever ghosty tribe? Because I'm going to be honest with you, that ghost, the ghost cats seem kind of cool. I kind of like them. Uh, but yeah, for now, that's going to be it. Um, recall three companions. I need to remember to do that. Like, I still haven't, like, internalized that mechanic of recalling stuff to bring them back. Because um, I do want to get another companion. Because it does feel like, um, it feels like Snoof. The, uh, tanky kind of build I want to try and create doesn't work well with snow uh but for now that'll be it um i hope you guys all enjoyed today's video for wild frost um again uh if you guys have any idea any tips and tricks i would love to hear them uh what you think is good what you think is bad in the game and if you guys just enjoy the video in general i'd love it if you could leave a like or a comment down below always helps me out and always helps out the channel and if you guys want to keep up with the wild frost content you can always go and subscribe to the channel as well also if you want to watch me play some more wild hearts you can go and check me out over on twitch at twitch.tv slash where i stream pretty much every single day anyway though with that all said and done thank you all again once more for watching this video and until i see you guys in the next one uh bye